Okay, so suppose you have a quiz that you like so much you want to keep reusing it for your other classes and uh, you want to share it with your friends and everything else. There are a couple ways you can go about doing this, but today I want to talk about a way that makes it really efficient to uh, make to do what I just said. So what we can do inside of the spreadsheet view uh, of our quiz is to go to file and well we have this feature to make a copy we could if we wanted to just make a copy and that can work but we're not going to do that we're going to do something different so if I click cancel over here I want to do something else I'm going to create what's known as a template if I go to file and then new from template I can click on this link and it'll take me to the templates page uh, there's a whole gallery of templates that we can use um, to start get started with Google Forms that's kind of hidden but uh, for our own purposes we can create our own templates from things that we like so for example this quiz here that we want to reuse over and over so what I can do is this back on the templates page I can click on submit a template what this will do is it will create a template um, from that form that we want to create and so we have to first pick a document so I'm going to uh, choose from our Google Docs uh, the quiz document that we just created. So let's click on this link here. It will show up in my list of forms over here. So on the side I have documents, presentations, spreadsheets, and forms. I'm going to select forms and I'm going to select quiz. I mean, since I just edited it recently, I will select this guy and select that guy. Okay. And now since I'm uh, submitting this template, I'm going to submit this to a public gallery. It means that I'm allowing anybody to make use of this. So if you're not comfortable doing that, then perhaps that's not this is not the thing for you. But if you're comfortable sharing your templates with anybody else who may be interested, it's a pretty straightforward way to uh, easily make uh, copies of, of a form for your own use. I will just make a very short description of what this, uh, uh, this form, this quiz is about. So this is a simple multiple choice and free text <laughs> quiz. Now since I'm uh, since we are professors here uh, I'm going to put this category into uh, students and teachers which is off the page but uh, it's students and teachers and as far as the other category I will make this I'll just leave that alone. I don't have to put these in, by the way. I, I just feel like I should. All right. At this point, um, it just reminds us that anyone will be able to view our template and any changes we make to it. So if you're comfortable doing that, great. If you're not, then this is not for you. But at this point, I'm going to click Submit Template. And it will show up in a list of my templates. So it just uh, will just show up. And I have a, another kind of template that's called quiz, as it turns out, um, listed here. So that's kind of why this is showing up right away. Um, but it'll say here that your template has been saved and should be visible in the template gallery momentarily. Momentarily can mean a few minutes or can mean a few hours. So it can take some time. So be patient uh, while it, uh, uh, before it shows up. Um, so it's kind of a... Yeah, it's, it's, it's kind of got bugs in it, but uh, in any event, uh, that's that. Um, but the nice thing about the, the purpose of having templates, of course, is to uh, reuse uh, something that you like over and over again. So I have, on my own time, made a few other um, templates that I've used in other classes. And so if I want to ever reuse one of them, I can just say, use this template over here. Another way I can use templates is to go back into Google Docs and I can say create and there's a special thing that says from template. If I say create from template it will bring me back to uh, the template gallery on Google. There's a list of public templates, templates I've used as well as my own templates that I've put together. So if I click on my templates the quiz will appear. Now this is an older quiz that I had produced at another point in time. But in any event, um, at that point I can say use this template, say for example this quiz, which is a different one, and I will have the ability to reuse that quiz over and over in whatever class I want. 
and it'll actually show up in Google Docs over here as copy of quiz. So each time I create a new uh, new quiz or new whatever, it will show up there. So there you have it.